Tired of doing the same boring old tombstone glitch in Season 4 Reloaded? Alright, well I've got a solution for you guys that you're gonna love and it's very very simple, you don't have to do anything except, well I'll get to that in a bit. Firstly, let's take a look at my sponsor, Mitch Cactus. Because he offers a range of services for Modern Warfare 3 including camos, camos and more camos for both Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2. He's also got pre-made accounts for Modern Warfare 3 and then also zombie schematics boost. You got the nuke skin boost, over 10,000 customer reviews, we can check out yourself. Go ahead and use code Joey for 5% off links in the description and now let's get back to the video. So the first half of this video I'm going to be showing you the new method which is way better and way easier but if you really want to know how to do the tombstone glitch solo I'll be showing you how to do that after I go through the first one anyway. So first things first for this bad boy is guys you're going to want to subscribe to the channel and you're going to, want to drop a like in the video as well. These are both going to help you out because it just does, trust me. Nah, but seriously, what you want to do is, guys, join my Discord. It's got over 7,000 members that are currently active right now when everyone is helping each other out. You want schematics? They've got your back. You want money? They've got your back. You want someone to play with, do glitches, unlock this, unlock that, get weapons dropped for you? They've got your back. And this is where you see it, guys. Today, for example, we had this bad boy right over here. I wanted a red worm to fight with him, and then he got a teammate right there, and they play there. Who's trying to play in Stable Rift? And here we go. Another example today. And then we scroll down a little bit. Here we go right Right here talk to the dms done 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 everyone's helping each other out everyone's very friendly and helpful even adding each other up and playing with each other that's exactly what my server's for and that's what happens all day every day for modern warfare 3 zombies warzone whatever you want but it's the most useful for modern warfare 3 zombies because you can get schematics and etc it's so good and so easy and now if you really really want to do the tombstone glitch this is how it's done solo so first things first all you're going to need is a tombstone perk and all the things that you want to duplicate or have in the game with you when you want to um attack the unstable rift that's all you need so bring all the most powerful stuff you got and that's it Alright guys, so for this one, you're going to need to find three obelisks that you can complete in the game. So we're going to make sure that the third obelisk that you do is in this location right here. And the reason for that is because it's so close to the teleporter, which will teleport you to the out-of-bounds glitch, and you can do the whole thing like that. So what you want to do is finish the last third obelisk right here to go to the unstable rift, but don't activate the rift yet. What you're going to do is go back to the teleporter that we usually do in the other methods. Go there and put in the code I'm showing you on screen. So do this code right here. Once you do that, then you're going to go back to the unstable rift, start that bad boy, and then run or use the Scorcher to back to the teleporter. Go into the teleporter, come to the out of bounds area like this. And once it teleports you to the beach, you're gonna go to the uh, map and make sure you vote yes before it gets one second. So go ahead, vote yes like that. There we go. And then do the exact same thing. Wait till it's six seconds, go out of bounds. And then once that happens, guys, it's gonna teleport you. You don't have to do anything. It's just going to teleport you to the unstable rift area. And once that happens, you're in a dark ether. What's going to happen is if you don't make it and you don't finish the thing or you don't do what you want to do, if you do manage to die, don't worry. Just bleed out, close the game. When you come back in the zombies, your tombstone is going to be there, still there. You can go ahead and activate that bad boy. So go to your tombstone, get all your stuff and try again. You can keep on doing this until you want to stop and you've done all the challenges that you wanted to do or whatever you want to complete the dark ether, etc. So go ahead, do this, guys. Got any questions? Let me know in the comments down below. Drop a like, subscribe. Subscribe and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Joey Rams. Yeah.